Hey, what's up? This is DT with another very helpful video for you. And don't forget to subscribe and like as we will have more videos like this in the future. Today, we will be going over how to fill out a medical questionnaire at an orthopedic clinic. So first off, there are many private clinics in Japan. You can't walk 300 meters without walking past some type of clinic. Talking urologist, ENT clinics, orthopedic clinics, cardiology, dermatology, neurology, gastrology, all types. And they all take walk-ins and you can pay with cash if you don't have Japanese health insurance. I have never been turned away from any clinic in my 20 plus years being here in Japan. Never. They have some of the best doctors out there, very helpful, patient and caring. Trust me, I know. I advise you to pay attention to what I am about to go over as this is for your own benefit. Now with that said, let's go over some things. So first, when you come into a clinic, you have to take your temperature and sanitize and always wear a mask. Next, when you approach the counter, sign in with your name in katakana. If you're not sure how to write your name in katakana, do not worry. Watch my video on all katakana characters here and pick the ones for your name. Next, the ladies at the counter will ask you if this is your first time at this clinic and you can reply, Hajimete, meaning it's my first time. Then they will hand you a form much like this one to fill out so they can get your information and issue you a card for their clinic. This is how it's done at every clinic. They may also ask you if you have a Japanese medical insurance or Hoken. If you do, you can hand them your green laminated card. If you don't, then let them know you will be paying in cash by saying, Genkin de shiharaimasu. After you sit down, it's time to fill this out. You can't be helped if you don't fill this out and it can be kind of scary if you cannot read this. Speaking Japanese is not the same as reading Japanese. Do not worry though, DTJ is here and we're going to get through it. Are you with me? Are you with me? So the first line is Shimei Name Seibetsu Gender, the first options for man, the second options for woman. Birthday, you're going to put the year, month, then date. Age, address, make sure you enter your zip code in there. Your phone number. Do you have long-term care insurance or are you applying for long-term care insurance? So are you in a process of applying for long-term care insurance? Answer yes or no. If you choose yes, then what type of long-term care insurance are you on? If you look in the parentheses over here, the top ones for support, the bottom options for care, you see the support has two levels, one and two. The care option has five different levels. These are for people that are bedridden or they have some type of debilitating condition that impacts their lives daily. If you never heard of this, then you more than likely do not have long-term care insurance and this does not apply to you. Is today's symptoms a result of a trauma or a car accident? Answer yes or no. Where did your trauma occur? Is it the result of a car accident? Did it happen at work? Did it happen on your way to work? At school? Playing sports? Doing housework? Or etc. Specify. What kind of job do you have? Do you have a job where you're always constantly standing? How about sitting? Are you carrying heavy things? Are you a mover or something like that? A driver? Driving trucks? Or are you simply a computer worker? Do you work at a PC? You're sitting down, sitting in front of a screen all day? Or etc. 
活やスポーツをされている場合、運動の種類をご記入ください。If you're in a sports club, what kind of sports club are you in? You can specify right next to that basketball, volleyball, tennis, something like that. Where are your symptoms? And you can see there are many options. Let's work through them head, face, neck, shoulder, upper arm, elbow, forearm. Wrist, fingers, then you can specify which finger. Chest, back, lower back, kind of in the tailbone area. Inner thigh, close to the groin. Thigh, knee, shin, ankle, legs, toes, the soles of your feet, or etc. 細かな部位がありましたらご記入ください。If the area of your symptoms are not listed, please specify. 症状がある部位は両側、それとも左右どちらですか Now, which side of the body are your symptoms on? Are they on both sides? The left side or the right side of your body? 症状はいつ頃からありますか When did this problem start? You can specify the year, month, date. You can even specify AM or PM. And if you know the minute that happened, you can even put the minute. Or do you have any idea what is causing your problem? Yes or no? Let us know what you were doing. When this happened. 交通事故や怪我の場合は受賞起点を図解していただけると助かります。And finally, you can illustrate what happened if you wanted to. You can draw it out on the back. So that is how you fill out a form at an orthopedic clinic in Japan. Subscribe for other clinic videos as this channel is made to assist you while in Japan. So why not subscribe? I'm DT. Thanks for watching. See you on the next one. DT out.